Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls. We're at uh, the bottom of Blight Town near the bonfire, and oh, what, what is, wait, what, what is wrong with me? I have a big ugly face. What is going on? Nah, just kidding. We're uh, what, ah, what, ah, what is wrong with my face? Ah, uh, just kidding. Uh, I think it's my mask. It's it's just my mask. It's all right. Okay, so, uh, uh so everything's okay. It's good. Uh, we're not fast rolling, but anyway, we're at the bottom of Blight Town because I thought it might be a good time for us to take on the Great Hollow. So let's go ahead and do that for such things. We might need an iron ring to get through this. Whoops. To get through this mucky swamp of gooby gooberness of goop. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, yeah, and let's get rid of our demon catalyst. Yeah, I leveled up to intelligence level 14 just for that goofy joke. But that's my favorite spell, by a long shot. Um, and to be fair, I don't use a lot of magic. Uh, Great Hollow is a totally optional area. Hey guys, it's been a while since we've been here. Whoa. Uh... I got all quiet there like I was fighting some terrible boss or battle or something. Um, a totally optional area, but it leads actually to one of my favorite areas as far as design and everything goes. But I've only been to the area one time, so this is going to be... And I've only been it through the Great Hollow extensively like one time. So this is going to be a bit of a... Not exactly blind, but, you know, close anyway. So let's go ahead and do that. Whoa. Woohoo! Jump down there. Let's two hand this. Somebody died. That actually seems to happen every time uh, I come down here. Alright, so the most. Uh, this is mostly treacherous root uh, climbing or limb climbing. There are quite a few crystal lizards this way. But I don't know how to get to most of them. Like, I think even if we spotted them before they went away, we might could have a hard time getting to them. It's also, there's one, or there's an item there. So there are crystal lizards, and there are also a lot of items that I don't know if we'll be able to get to. But ain't no thing. We're just going to have fun with it today. There's an item. We might be able to get that one. Geronimo! Tight knot chunk. Okay, so these are these jerks that are going to try to curse us. The basilisks. Uh, an interesting thing about them is they have these big eyes. But actually, they don't have big eyes. They actually have... Uh, whoa, the, we are... we got to watch the curse uh, build up there. We don't have a lot, do not have a lot of curse resistance right now. Oh, no! Well, we're cursed. We're one of these ugly, flaky guys. I think we're cursed with a bad frame rate at this point. So that's what that looks like to me. All right, we, we're cursed. All right. FPS 5. Oh, the game even thinks it's pretty awful. Okay, I'm trying to, I'm trying to agree with them. Uh, so we're cursed. This ought to make things interesting. We actually have some purging stones. What? Huh. That was a little bizarre. So good thing we rested up here. Uh, well, it actually didn't curse us, apparently. So that's kind of odd. But I'm not complaining. Let's actually... Uh, <laughs> on that note, we don't need this anymore. Let's put the curse bite ring on. Why not? Do everything we can to... Avoid being cursed again. Because curse is no fun. Being cursed is the pits. Quite frankly. So I guess we can get to there. Whew, that was a little bit of a leap of faith. Red Titanite chunk. We could jump over to that. Let's just walk around. And I really want to kill these uh, sons of guns. What I was saying about their eyeballs, before I was so brutally interrupted by their their curse nonsense, is that um, they have these big giant eyeballs. But if you look closely, 
They actually don't. They actually have these smaller set of eyes. Well, I see their shadow. They actually have a smaller set of eyes. Whoa, hey, buddy. Right beneath that. Haha. -ha. Let's see if we can't get a. Well, he's going to topple off, of course, so. We might not have to. We may not get to see it, but that's alright. So we're going to try to make our way down carefully. This area is a little treacherous from in my limited experience with it. This, for instance, appears to be a dead end. Oh, wait, here's a ladder. Oh, but see, we're passing up a lot of items that way. We're not going to worry uh, about that. We're just going to... We're focused on making it down to the bottom here. Wow, that was actually really simple. Last time I went, I must have not seen that ladder. I must have gone some more complicated way. Oh, crap. Okay, we're not dead yet. We're still in this... Hey, buddy. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't either. Oh, no, you don't either, I said. He asked him knowingly. Okay, let's see if we can't get a zoom in on their eye. No, I can't. Oh, yeah, okay, so right... You can barely see it. Right below, there's a little bitty P of an eye there. Beneath his regular eye, it's that little light spot. Yeah, that's an eyeball. That's his... I don't know, I was going to say that's his actual eye. He may just have two sets of eyes. But, anyway, that's kind of weird. Which is exactly what you would expect from the Dark Soul uh, art designers. Item over there. Don't know how to get to that. This, uh, this branch makes a lot of noise for being a solid branch. Sounds like we're stomping around on, like, sheetrock or something. Or some hollow floor. Hey there, Mr. Shroom. I feel like, uh, this makes me think of the Fantasia, you know, with the, uh... The animation, the mu music with the uh, mushrooms dancing around. I forget what the name of the song is, exactly. <laughs> you're far from scary if you're just going to commit suicide like that. So I don't know if they're signaling, signaling to their, you know, other mushroom guys. Now the big guys like this, these are a little more scary. I remember they got some, they got a bit more backbone. Yeah, like the, we barely took off any health there. That's, that's really fun. And without our chlorine earring, we're totally filling the uh, lack of stamina here. Don't fall off. Oh crap, we're cornered, we're cornered. We can't get out of here, we're stuck. This is a bit unfair. Oh yeah, we're going to take you with us. We're going to take you with us. How do you feel about that? Well, we killed all but one of them. Now we're going to get our souls, and this time we're not going to get stuck in that little trap of theirs. Okay, looking for... Oh, here's... I was going to say a ladder, but we have a walkway here. I guess this is the same one we took last time. Yep, because there's the item we couldn't get to last time. Coming up on our, our mushroom friends here, of course, in a second. So we probably don't need curse resistance anymore. Let's go ahead and put our chlorine earring back on. So we could probably skip, we could probably like jump to some of these mushrooms and skip some of this. It's stroking off tonight, boys. Thousand uh, damage, wow. 
So it was two swings, did a thousand damage. Uh, can we get this without getting stuck again? Let's try it. Okay, so this time we're going to just be really careful not to fall into that little pit again. This is how we methodically just destroy this these fellas. Hey! Your little... Oh no, he's gonna push us into our, our little trap, isn't he? What are you gonna do without your papa there, huh? Yeah, what are you gonna do about that? Oh, there's three of these guys. I make a living killing shrooms like you, man. Come on. He's stuck, it looks like. It's really bizarre. So he's blocking the other guy. Well, we'll take advantage of this little hiccup. Whoa, that was supposed to be a attack. He does some serious damage too, man. <laughs> Big and clumsy. Ooh. Oh, I tried to roll out of the way of that. Whew. Yeah, these guys are kind of kind of touchy. They kind of seem to take this uh, whole fighting thing personally. Okay, since you're just standing here, we'll just take pot shots at you. Too bad, too, because they're kind of cute, and they uh, remind me of Elizabeth from the Ulysses Hill Sanctuary. It's a shame that, you know, we got to kill them. I believe this is Ash Lake. Yes, it is. So there's a big nasty hydra out here, I remember. Who I'm, I've never taken on. So let me see how that goes. Actually, uh, looks like this is actually going to be a pretty good spot to end the episode. So, uh, in the next episode, of course, we'll continue through the Ash Lake. But uh, thanks for tuning in, and I hope to see you there.